Okay, let me show you how to assign a turbo button on Steam. First, you have you need to have Steam opened and a controller connected to your PC. In my case, it is the PS4 controller that I use for my Steam games. Next step is what you have to do. You have to go to the big picture mode. You can go to the icons down here, go to the Steam icon, right click and go big picture mode. Or go up here to this little icon right here on the top right, right next to your name, and enter big picture mode. Skip this animation, go to uh, library, go to any game that you want Turbo assigned with. In my case, it's Final Fantasy XII. Um, then you go to the left side right here, go to manage game, then you go. First you want to see you if your controller is already connected and if Steam does recognize your controller, so go to controller options. In my case you can see it's already connected, everything is good. Um, if it doesn't, you should check out this uh, options menu right here, this should help you uh, a lot. Um, and if everything is okay, we can go on to controller configuration. And right off the bat you see a ton of buttons right here. Um, however, for FF12, I would highly recommend assigning uh, the turbo button because uh, you cannot like toggle it on or off during gameplay. I would highly recommend putting it onto a button that uh, will act solely as your turbo button. And uh, in my opinion, the share button is the most useless one of the bunch. So I assigned uh, the turbo button uh, on share. So what I did is I clicked on the button itself right here, see it's highlighted as so I'm clicking on the button and then at first it was um, on, it was binded to the select button so when you go to binding you press on this little icon right here then you see your keyboard, your mouse and your controller and everything, like a ton of stuff um, and then you just press the button you want to bind it to, and in my case it's going to be the X button. However, for uh, this layout right here, it is going to be referred as the A button. So if you have the A button or the cross button, it should both be fine. Just, yeah, that should be fine. Then on this right, uh, right here is the turbo button, the one that everyone talks about. So, uh, when you first go into your settings, it's obviously off, uh, but it's basically just an option that you have to turn on, and the repeat rate is starting at, I think, this much. So if you want to go full speed with your turbo, crank it all the way up to 11. And uh, yeah, that's about it. Press back, press done, uh, escape a couple of times, and then you can exit big picture mode. Thank you all for watching and uh, have a good one.